<laughs> the gift. Whoever you is, man, bruh. You make sure you maybe whoever you would make sure you definitely use your discernment, okay, about who you're giving certain information to. Like, as far as whatever this is, like you hit the lottery, don't be telling nobody that. Like, you come up with an idea, do it, don't tell nobody or something. You dig a real skill, like, don't be somebody, don't need to know nothing that you got going on. Somebody is they're trying to, um block something this is every day okay this is any 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 day i show up to y'all it's gonna always be you winning something you're getting something from the good things you've done and the good things that you earned and it's always somebody right there trying to stop it what i said every every time it's never gonna be a reading to where it ain't somebody trying to set someone up that's just where we at right now get the girl school it's sad but it is what it is you're getting the gift you are manifesting at a rapid rate. And I mean, it is so, bro, like I could cry for whoever you are because you deserve it. Somebody is trying to like make it seem like you don't deserve something you do. It's weird. It's it's like I'm 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 trying to I'm trying to process how you don't deserve. Whoever you are, you deserve all of this good stuff. You do. Bro, you deserve to have somewhere to live, bro. You deserve to have a car to get around with your kids. Somebody is weird. Somebody in this energy is literally weird. Like, they don't want you to have nothing. It's weird. Bro, you deserve to have somewhere to lay your head, shouty. You deserve to have a car. You deserve to have money, food, all of that. You, like, you can't have these? Like, no, no. See, that's what we're going to stop this here. We, that's why we don't talk down on ourselves. What I said. That's why we always affirmation. I am deserving. I am beautiful. I am wealthy. I am healthy, honey. I am God's child. I am protected. I'm anointed. I'm favored. I'm loved. I'm respected. That's why we, that's why we call our power back. That's why we speak good on ourselves. Bro, you deserve every good thing that's coming your way. You work for it. It's not like you just being handed something. If you were... If you were being handed some, you deserve that too. However, the most high God chooses to bring your blessings in your life, whether he's giving you some from what you worked hard for or from some that you just being paid back by the universe for. A lot of y'all are still getting good karma from some you did 15 years ago. Y'all folk living out good karma from past lives. I'm trying to figure this out how y'all folk don't deserve nothing. How is it every time we get into the end of that? Why, that why I'm gonna come up. I'm gonna come tell you, bro. You worthy. You're worthy. You don't owe nobody no explanation. You're worthy. You know if this is you doing this to someone trying to block their life or someone's doing this to you. The person who is being blocked, they deserve this lifestyle. You don't. That's why you don't have it and you won't. That's why this person will not get whatever this is that's yours. And they're not going to block you from it either. Y'all folks are beautiful. Why you don't deserve to be beautiful? It ain't your fault that your mama chose your daddy. It ain't your fault that these women got horrible taste in men. And they had anything with these men. That, that's not your problem. You can only do something about what you can control. You can't control how you look physically. God created you exactly how you're supposed to be. Somebody is so jealous of your beauty. Masculine, so handsome, you can dress, you keep your hair cut. They, they, they claim that you feminine because you get your nails and your toes manicured. Because you keep up with yourself. I don't think nothing is wrong with that for a man to keep himself up, his hands and his feet. Because baby, you lay next to me. You're not going to lay next to me with no ashy ass hands and feet and crusty toes and all of that. You go to the crusty crab with that right here. Yeah, I don't care nothing about that, sweetie. You can't get mad because a person takes care of themselves. That's weird. You're mad at a woman because she keep her nails done. She keep herself up. She keep her lashes done, her nails and toes done. You're mad at that person for that. Why don't you go and do it? Why don't you go keep up with yourself? This person going to always rise above everything you're doing to them and everything you're sending. Every time you see this person, they're going to look better and better and better. They're going to be doing better and better and better. Because they put in love into them. They're not seeking love from no one else but the most high. 
Define feminine masculine. Y'all deserve these good things. I don't care. I'm telling you that you deserve it. You've been out here working your ass off. And it's not even like hard work and labor and chopping wood and all of that. And you, or working at a whatever the case is. Like if you putting in hard work for that too. You deserve to be paid, right? But bro, you deserve good things. Somebody just don't want you to be blessed. But if you're already blessed, they can't do anything about that. Can't do anything about a person in the heart that they have. Like, this person's a good person. They're going to always generate good. I mean, I'm just saying. You can't change this person's nature. Somebody thought that they destroyed you. I'm getting a whole lot of reporting. Somebody always on the computer. Typing. Shotta can go do data entry. This person can make an ebook. They can do anything, but they're typing, reporting you. Just so busy, focused on you. I mean, every day. This is every single day. Somebody trying to block you. Bro, you will not be blocked. Somebody type, I will not be blocked. I will not be stopped. Matter of fact, just type unstoppable. You're unstoppable. If these people wanted to bring you down, they should have done this when you were in your south node. Y'all people are in your north node. It is nothing that nobody going to do to block you. I keep saying that. Like, what, is, what, what are you trying to block someone else for anyway? You're, you're completely jealous. As to, and then these people are so, they always wondering why you remove yourself from them. What I said. You dig a root skew? Well, why we ain't friends no more? Why they don't want to date me no more? Bruh, I can't be around you because you a hater, bruh. Everything I do, you talk down on it. You wish bad on me. You go and you, you cast spells on me. I can't persevere. I can't last with you. Leave it up to you. I would have been gone a long time ago. I'm here right now by the grace of God. By the grace of God. God is so good. He's so beautiful. And I'm here right now. Only I can attest to my own testimony. And I know a lot of y'all can agree. Bro, we only hear about the grace of God. Bro, these people be trying to literally destroy us. Destroy us because we're beautiful. Because we got gifts and we use our gifts. Our gifts make room for us. You mad at me for that? You mad because I love God? Because I won't curse my father like you did? You mad because you sold your soul and I didn't sell mine? It is always so funny because the things people be mad at you about, they be mad at their own choices. The results from their own choice. You had a choice and you chose wrong. How are you mad with me? Why are you not mad at yourself? Because it's always somebody else's fault. Most of y'all, your life is surrounded by other people. It's always other people involved. You can't ever just be yourself. Be with yourself. You can't ever mind your business. Whoever you is, there is absolutely no way you can always just stay closed off. Even in isolation, you got people scrying, conjuring up Ouija boards, trying to see what you're doing. It is so weird. People do spell work on y'all, witchcraft to isolate you. I'm hearing invisible spells. Somebody literally did an invisible spell on you. Wanted nobody to see you at all. Even in that isolation that they feel they caused you, they were still stalking you. Still need to know every move. Oh, let me make sure I can watch them just in case they think they're going to get out of this trap. Let me stop them, watch them, make sure I know everything they're doing. Let me connect myself to people that they're connected to just in case. I need my ear to the streets at all times. I need to know what's going on with this person all the time. Because I saw something good coming in their life. And ain't no way they're going to get it because I isolated them. This person been playing, trying to play God in your life. They've been trying to dictate your life. The spirit of Jezebel keeps coming up. My dad keeps on bringing that to my attention. Jezebel, you are about to defeat Jezebel. You already have, but I'm talking about Jezebel is about to be completely wiped out. This spirit resides in a lot of different people. And it'd be people that you would never think. Sometimes it could be your own children. And, you know, when you are vibrating on a spiritual level, it's different. You dig a real skill? It's different vibrating in the spirit because it is just so many different ways that the enemy can attack you 
in spirit. The most that you could like the best way to protect yourself is to be by yourself. And that sucks sometimes, don't it? But sometimes it's the best thing to do is to separate yourself. That shit will keep your, your family members and everything safer. Everything will be better to make sure you're out of the way of shit. Because normally when you're isolated, if the Most High God sets you apart from everyone else, it's some shit going on. I promise you that. And sometimes God will remove you because the attacks are so heavy, it starts to affect other people around you. It don't even touch you. So the enemy will start chopping at your family. They'll start chopping at innocent people. Breaking them down slowly but surely. People who are more susceptible to the attacks. It's easier to get into the bodies of non-believers or not believers yet. Those who have not been introduced to the path. Those who have not been introduced to the Holy Spirit. Those who are not familiar with the Lord. And who are strong in faith and that won't ever turn. Everybody don't got your faith. Everybody is not finna say, you know what? I can walk away from all this right now and regenerate because I know God got me. I can leave everything behind, everyone behind, and I know I'm going to be good. You grew to have that kind of faith. Your faith allowed you to continue to have faith, and it just built up more faith. And with your faith, there was confirmation. You didn't just have faith in something that God didn't show you why. You had faith and he shows you why you believed. What I said, it's all about the most high. You don't got to be no nun or, you know, I mean, whatever the case is, but people, people got different ways of praising God. They got different ways of serving God. You don't got to be perfect, bro. I got tattoos and all of that. It, I mean, came from things of the world over time. And it's a little bit too late. To, and I don't regret none of my tattoos, but I'm just saying, like, if I started over and knew all about my dad from, like, day one, like, okay, it's all about God and not me, I still would have got my tattoos. Like, I still would have done the same thing. You dig a real skin? So, it's like, you don't really change much. It's just, it's, it's better to know where you are with God. And it's like somebody tried to completely take that away from you, but it's weird like you have a leg up because you know, there is absolutely no way you can deny God. God has done some things so miraculous in your life to where you could not deny him. Either like there is just no way you can. It don't matter what happens. You can't deny him. Confirmation. Hold on, y'all. What's up, baby? Hello? What's up, babe? Hey. Yeah, what you doing? Okay. Have a good day. Huh? Okay, I'm doing good. You doing okay? All right, baby. All right, I love you too. Have a good day, okay? Alright. Sorry about that, y'all. Somebody's scared. Thank you. What else is here? What else is here? It's like we're in the, it's like the <clears throat> The list that these people go through to just like they do the dirtiest stuff to y'all. And you'll be like, wow, like you really thought to do that? Like who even thinks like that? Yeah. You're gonna be made aware that somebody the whole entire time, their whole mission was to try to get around you, get information from you, to literally destroy you. Period. Queen. What else is there? Crazy. A present and offer nurturance, grow potential. You like, bro, you got potential to do whatever you want to do. Somebody trying to take this from you. And it's definitely something here about your beauty. It is somebody here that is so freaking jealous of your beauty. It's disgusting. Like, this is so disgusting. 
This person is wishing all kind of crap on your beauty. Just weird. Ew. Crown chakra and dang on divine feminine. Like, jealous of your mind, jealous of your beauty, jealous of everything, especially your divine masculine. And then they got the nerve to be doing magic on you. I'm telling you, they always resort to spell words. Just dirty and dusty, nasty. This energy is horrible, man. Ew. Now I'm getting nauseous again. I wish this person would stop watching me. Like, seriously. It's like they get even more frustrated. Every time they, they go to look for you, they get even worse. Because every time they see you, you're looking better. You're sounding better. You're doing better. Everything is always better. You're constantly upgrading. Oh, we, you're constantly upgrading. Nobody's going to do nothing about it. And then it's so funny because they done, they done exhausted all of their resources. They don't have no more moves left. These people have done everything that they could do. They have exhausted every resource at their disposal, any person at their disposal. Now, everybody is wrapped up getting their karma. Everybody is in the energy of getting badass karma for what they did to you, and you're being placed on a pedestal again. How do they keep winning? What is it that we're not doing? Or, or, or I thought that we had sabotaged them. How are they still? Why is their business still booming? How is this person, sweetie? Because what goes around comes back. This person got product. This person, nobody will ever forget this person. Anybody who meet this person could never forget this person. This person has an energy that will always linger. Always in a positive way. Even with all the dirt that this person tried to throw on your name. Somebody is literally in this energy trying to make you look like someone that you're just not. That you won't ever be. You dig a real school? You won't ever be this because that's not who you are. How they going to turn you into someone that you're just not? That's not who you are. Like, it's just not who you are. It's weird. Like, somebody's literally trying to force something on you. The trauma, the betrayal, all of this, the, the slander, the lies, whatever. All of that was supposed to break you down. It was supposed to make you give up. If the world looked at you, if the whole world turned their back on you, you were supposed to turn your back on the world. You were supposed to turn your back on the most high. Child, all of this stuff be pushing us to God. You hurt my feel. You hurt me any kind of way. I'm running to my dad. I'm going to go to somebody I know that's going to solve the issue. For sure. In a way that you can't do nothing about. This is crazy, bro. Y'all folk deserve your life. Romantic love. And do not ever feel bad for living good. Don't ever feel bad for looking good. Don't feel bad for being good. Don't. That's genuinely who you are. If you want to donate to charity, donate to it. Who is somebody to tell you, why you giving all that money to them people? You don't know them people. Anybody like that, get rid of them, folk. Get rid of them. But they can take your card and go swipe it down Rodeo all day. They can go swipe for all these bags and all this shit that don't mean anything. But when you're giving to charity, you want to go and donate things, they hounding you for that? They judging you for that? Man, come on, bro. This don't make no sense. You're about to be paired up with somebody who on the same motherfucking frequency. Perception and earth. You definitely could be dealing with an earth sign. And you definitely got like messed up trying to bury your earth sign's finances. Sweetheart, we are literally the mascot of a dollar bill. Literally. We rule earth. We rule material. Taurus, Virgos, Capricorns, we rule money. Period. Just stop it. Just stop, honey. We rule good looks and all of that. We rule it all. Anything material, we rule it. Spiritual too. Anything tangible in the spirit or on this physical realm, we rule that. So you went trying to do spell work on a divine feminine or masculine's money? You, you shouldn't have never done that. Ever. This person not ever going broke. They're not ever going broke. Ever. Somebody type, I'm not broke. We're not broke. God's people ain't broke, sweetie. 
It's about time them tables turn. Jesus flipped the table. You luckily they only turning. Because I'm about ready to flip the table on y'all. All you got to, I mean, the simplest solution I'm seeing here is to mind your business. Why is that so hard? Somebody creating fake accounts. Oh my God, this girl is a psycho. This girl is literally creating fake accounts, reaching out to you. As a man. For what? Seem like that's, this person got some kind of psychotic void that they're trying to feel mentally they're trying to communicate with you oh they reply back oh that hypes them up that's weird you got nothing else to do all day long creating all these fake ass accounts and i'm gonna let y'all know right now while it's 688 y'all in here i don't message nobody for nothing i have not ever in my life gotten on this app and asked nobody for no fucking money for no readings i don't do personal readings and if I do, they're live or you'll know that I'm doing them because I will announce it myself out of my mouth on video. That's not me reaching out to you. And I don't use the word beloved. I don't freaking speak like that. Don't send money to nobody. That's not me. My cash app information is on my profile and you have to spell every letter out if you want to give me anything and I don't ask for nothing. Okay, that's not me. It's just not me. It has not ever been me. Heart chakra. These messages are free. I don't go around asking people to get in their energy. That's it's too much. Why would I come ask you to read your energy? I mean, common sense here. Some people ain't got common sense either. They get scammed. They don't have common sense. I'm going to just say that. I'm going to put that out there. If you know me, you've been following me the way that I speak. You should know I will never come asking you for nothing. I will never come asking you for a reading. Do I look like that? That's really an insult. Do I look like I'm going to come asking you for a reading? Do I look like I'm going to come and ask you, do you want a reading? I'm just saying miracle. I'm just saying, you got to use your common sense. You got to realize when you're being tricked. Yeah, you and your power. Somebody don't like this. Thank you very much. And I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just telling you straight up. Because I can't stand when people are being bamboozled and scammed and stolen from and tricked. I don't like that, especially using my name and my face. Don't ever in your life play with me like that. I don't move like that. So who the hell are you to try to move like that on my behalf, but to benefit you? That's not being beneficial to me. You're doing nothing but trying to ruin my name. And you're still not successful. It's pointless. What else is here? You deserve good stuff. Compassion. Keep having compassion, whatever this is. Just keep doing you, boo. Because like I felt, phase on, love is significant, okay? That's uh, phase on, love. He played Big Worm, right? And Friday. So something might be happening on Friday. This, this is where we going. This is what we came to get. It's a gift. It's the gift. It's something specific here that you're about to get. Thank you for my uh, coffee cup. Thank you, boo. I don't know why my lighting keeps turning down. Sorry, y'all. Thank you. Change. Change. What's up, you guys? Thank you for the compliments. Thank you. Thank y'all so much. All of this because you're beautiful. All of this because you're talented. All of this is because you're beautiful and talented. Thank you. It's all because you're beautiful and talented. That's it. Oh. 
Hold on, somebody keep calling my live stream. All of this because you're beautiful and talented. Sorry, y'all. Somebody named definitely Pierre. Prosperity. Thank you. Hold up. Pierre. Campbell. You. All of this crap because we fine. We fighting all this stuff because we're beautiful people. Hold up. God's people ain't broke. I'm gonna just keep saying that too. We're not broke. You gotta change your perspective. Okay? Somebody need to change and heal. Thank you for my gifts. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. You too. Have a good day at work. Break banks. All my riches are in heaven. Exactly. But see, the thing about it is, it's not just in heaven. Bruh, your riches are wherever you are. It's attached to your spirit. What God has stored up for you is what he just got saved up for you. But most of that stuff... He releases to you to have it with you, have it on you. It's like you got credit in the spirit. But sometimes you need to swipe and get money out of ATM sometimes, right? You got all of it in your bank. Well, you know it's in the bank. But sometimes you need physical cash. That physical currency, that energy that we hold and exude, that radiance that we show, that is that physical currency. God has given it. To, it's with us all the time. That's why someone's always trying to steal from you. They're trying to either steal or have you give it to them or something like that. It's your whole entire aura that attracts whatever it is that you may need in any situation. You're able to get it because spiritually you already have it. But you're unfortunately, I mean, fortunately and unfortunately, you're not there. You're here right now. So whatever you're here doing, you're going to have the necessary tools. You're going to have your necessities. And it's always somebody trying to tag along. This a motherfucker who ain't never got no cheese, don't no eggs. Hey, you got some eggs, you got some milk. They ain't never got shit, but they know you got it. So they're coming over to borrow it. And if they could, if they can get in your house, and if they ain't got to ask, they'll sneak it out your house. They'll come in and volunteer themselves into your things, help themselves to what's in your refrigerator. They'll help themselves in your closet. Oh, you don't wear this. You can't fit this. This will look better on me. They won't ever use their own resources because what they've got is not good enough to them. Queen. It's weird, bro. We are dealing with some weird creeps. Courtship. I mean, these are creeps that we're dealing with. And I say we as all of us. Hold up. I wonder why these people keep calling my life. I don't know these people. Thank you. I don't know what's going on this morning, you guys. I don't know. Somebody's doing something to my live stream, but whatever. What else is here? Somebody is just jealous. They're just jealous of you. They're jealous of me. They're jealous of us. God's people are not broke. Somebody type, God is not broke. God is not broke. God is lavish. God is rich. God is wealth. God is health. God is everything. He is not broke. God's people are not broke. My dad is not broke. So therefore, I am not broke. I am rich. I am healthy. I am wealthy. I am prosperous. 
So are you divine fail masculine? If you are in the upright, you indeed are. God ain't broke, baby. I don't know. Why do people always try to make it seem like people who love God are broke? But it's the spiritual people. Not so much of these pastors and things like that. They can have people give it to them all day long, preaching these false messages or whatever the case is. I'm not talking about those in the upright. They can appear to love my dad because a preacher is supposed to. But a person that does terror or something, we got to be looked at as the money. But we're way more abundant than you. Oh. What else is here? I can read you with anything, truly. I can read you with anything. I can read you with nothing. I can get anything and read you with it. I can read you with every item in my home. It's your energy. It's crazy. Those of y'all who know, you know. Somebody feel like your life too easy. They feel like something you're doing, you shouldn't be getting paid for. So that's why they're trying to block you. And that's why they can't. Welcome. Welcome to all my newbies. What else is here? Welcome to all my newcomers. Shout out to all 710 of y'all in the chat. Never ending story in the reverse. Thank y'all for supporting me as well. Thank y'all for being here, truly. Thank y'all for allowing me to read the energy. Thank y'all for being here. For sure. For y'all support on here and anywhere I go. Thank you. Very, very grateful for you. Okay. Thinker. And then you got orphan in the reverse. As long as you got your mind, you're good. As long as you got your mind made up is what I heard. As long as you got your mind made up to do whatever this is or whatever the case is, you're going to be just fine. As long as you got this agreement with the Father, you're going to be just fine. All you got to do is hold up your end. You tell God what you want. You come up with a plan with him and then you execute. Period. A change in the wind. Somebody's trying to come in and change something. They're trying to make sure you fall. You're not going to. Don't be scared. I'm telling you, you're not going to fall. These people are though. This divine feminine or this masculine is not ever falling off, sweetie. Like I said before, Yang Reverse, this is not even a divine masculine. This man wants to ruin your life because you have a new life. They can't access your energy. They can't regenerate anything off your energy. But my thing is, they're pissed off because they can't come with you. It's like a baby daddy. Or they feel like they're attached to you because y'all have a child or something. They're not allowed anywhere near you because of the betrayal. They betrayed you. On the, bro, these people be betraying us at our south node. That's how you know you are always meant to be a boss, bro. These people were betraying y'all when you ain't even have much. When you were driving that little beat up Honda right here, that little beat up Acura. <laughs> when you were driving that little beat up PC Cruiser right here, feel masculine. These folk betrayed y'all at them levels. They were jealous of you then. Bro, they were jealous of you when you were homeless, when you didn't even have none, when you were still living with your mama. Are y'all hearing me? Bro, these folk were jealous of y'all folk way before you started going to the gym. In your eyes, it was things you needed to work on, but in their eyes, they hated you. They hated everything about you. They never liked you. Ever. They couldn't beat you on them levels. Bro, these folk could never beat you when you were at your lowest in life. And the audacity of them trying that shit now. The audacity of you trying this. Like, save yourself the embarrassment, shout it. Save yourself the embarrassment. This person ain't going anywhere. I'm not going nowhere. If you're waiting on that, sis, you just gonna be waiting. Please don't hold your breath. You ain't, Michael Phelps. You ain't gonna hold your breath a long way in the fuck on this. I'm telling you, bro. You're just not deep knowing. We already know what's coming for us. Big truth to rule. We know we got blessings stored up. The most I got is releasing blessings to his children. But he's doing it in a very strategic way. And you're just mad because there's no divination spying you can do to hack into this person's life and see how to block them. You're not going to block this person. They cannot be stopped. You will not stop them. You will not stop me. You will not get in front of me. None of that. You can stay in your lane. That's what you can do. When you're in your lane, that shit don't matter to me. Just don't try to merge over here. You're going to end up in an HOV. Don't ever in your fucking life try to merge into my lane when I'm going at my own pace. Because you see me on the road and you feel the need to try to speed up or slow me down or whatever the fuck. Mm -mm. No. We fight this every day, fam. Masculine every day. 
bro, every day. It's like we're fighting the same entity. We're fighting the same thing. We're fighting the same thing every day. It's it's old. It's so old that it's not even affecting y'all. And please don't get my passion misconstrued for anger. I am nowhere near angry, sweetie. This confuses me. I need answers. It's confusing how somebody every day is trying to stop someone who is unstoppable. It's weird. And you don't even have a reason for this. This is too calculated and, and thought out. This is too thought out. This is a whole strategy to destroy somebody's entire existence because of jealousy, because you want to be them. Or somebody wants to be you. Exactly. What's the game? Because alive or gone, your energy is yours. It's, it's with you. Somebody think about getting rid of you. They're just going to swap out lives and souls. All your gifts are going to mysteriously go to them. Sweetheart, no. <laughs> no, it's not. I heard this person has to pass their gifts on. These gifts have to be passed on to you. You have to inherit these gifts. And this person's soul, ain't nobody ever going to inherit their gifts. It's only one of this person. And ain't nobody going to occupy this person's gift but this person. While they're alive, when they go, they're going to reincarnate still as them in another fucking body. They're going to always have this soul. This shit is attached to this person. They're not ever going to just release their gifts to nobody. What the freak is wrong with you people? Somebody, they feel like your life too easy. They mad because you work smart and not hard. What I said, child. Thank you. Thank you, boo. I don't want to brag, but y'all doing all the bragging for me. Okay, here, child. Thank you. Crazy. A leg up in the reverse. Bro, don't ever feel bad for being blessed. I don't care, Shawty. Don't ever feel what you feel. Why would you feel bad for being blessed? If these people was in your situation, they wouldn't feel bad to be blessed. They'll be quick to be like, man, hell no, nah, I ain't giving you nothing. I'm going to enjoy this all by myself. Somebody, maybe because you're not sharing something with them. You don't owe them shit. You don't owe this person anything. Or somebody don't owe you a damn thing, Shawty. They don't owe you anything. All this reporting and stalking and all of that. You got, you, your time is, you're you literally, like, you, you really are pushing it. <laughs> Corbin Blue, you're pushing this shit to the limit right here. Yeah. You doing a whole lot right here. What else is here? Somebody is learning how to garden or something. Or it's something about planting seeds. See? Sunflower seeds may be significant. Serendipity to be fair in the reverse. Ranch or blue, not blue cheese, ranch. Do they have blue cheese sour cream? Um, sour cream. Blue cheese. Sunflower seeds. Thank you for my crown. Good luck is on your side. Your, your look has changed. For the better, I feel. Something was not fair. It wasn't done fairly. To be fair, it's in the reverse. Someone done right. Somebody's intentions was not pure. Their intention was to destroy you. That's why it's not working. Anytime you go into something with ill intention, sweetie, you will never in your life enjoy it. <laughs> like, you won't get the satisfaction. You just won't. Like I felt, happy, happy reverse. You won't. This won't make you happy. Because the results that you're going to get is not going to make you happy. I'm telling you, like, this person is skyrocketing. It's like the more you do, keep doing it. That's why I'm saying. Keep doing whatever you're doing. It's not affecting them at all. It's weird. I don't get it because it's not working. That's the thing that be making me confused. If this is not working, you're not gaining anything. Milk and honey reverse. You're not getting anything. This person is receiving everything. It seems, like, don't you feel, I don't even want to know how you feel. I know you got to feel real small. 
You doing all of this to this person and then you go back to check and see if something worked and they looking even better. They're doing even better. And you over there looking dried up. Feeling dried up and drained. I know you feel very small. This person won't take that and say, dang, I might need to just leave this alone. No. They like, oh, maybe I need to add something stronger. Maybe I need to get more upset. Maybe I need to say it with this tone. Maybe I need to get this person to come in with me. Maybe I need to go on the south side of town. Maybe I need to go to a, a train track, a railroad track. Maybe I need to call on some darker spirits. Like, that's what this person thinks. They don't, they don't look at something like it's backfiring. They look at something like, oh, I need to redo something. I need to go and tweak some things. I need to add something in or take something out because it, it didn't work because of how I said it or what I said. Maybe I should rewrite this. Sweetie, the shit ain't working because it's just not working. And it's not going to. You are not even a divine feminine and you will never exchange gifts with this woman. You're weird. This man, you are not this man. You will never exchange gifts with this man, ever. You need to go to sleep, bro. Them bags under your eyes is definitely not from you taking trips nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't moving. You need rest. You need to sleep. Oh, you can't. Because every time you try to go to sleep, you're having nightmares. I mean, that's what you sent out to this person. Dirty as hell. What else is here? You're just getting what you were giving. Whoever y'all folks here, Divine Family Masculine, just understand that God has you covered, baby. I promise you, all that glitters, it was a bunch of illusions. Somebody was painting this seven of cups energy to you. One and six break down to seven. Yeah, this, this person was trying to paint illusion 16. Yeah, they were. And then they sat back watching something. I'm telling you, they were watching it to see if it works. And they were trying to see if they had blocked this. They didn't. They didn't block it. <laughs> Y'all felt pitiful. You're pitiful. It's pitiful, baby. What else is here? This is crazy. God morning. Yeah, fork in the road reverse. It's always, whoever you are, you always know where to go. Somebody trying to get you kicked out of your home. It's like their, their main focus, like whoever this person is, their main focus is to get you either kicked out of your house. Well, they all, they want all of this shit to happen to you, but it's not. In Jesus' name, it's not. We're going to rebuke it. They want you out of your home. They want you homeless in the streets, literally. They want you ugly, fat. You know, shit like that. Like, none of that is happening. That's not who you are. Somebody's trying to turn you into someone that you're not, literally. They want you to be unrecognizable, but not in a good way. They want people to literally not recognize you because you, you're, you, you've just done so bad in life. No, that's not what's happening. It's an adverse effect. You're looking even better. And people don't recognize you because they like, damn, it can't be divine fail masculine. Damn, that's him. That's her. Shit. What I've been doing all my life. Kind of energy. They didn't want people to recognize you. Oh, okay. That's the backfire. My dad took that negative energy that you tried to send and literally made us unrecognizable. People really like, damn, you down. Shout to look real good. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah. Shit really is good. I know. What else is here? Shit is really good. And you don't want to mean anything with these people. Yeah, trying to get you taken out of the community because you do something so poised. Yeah, you're building blocks. Yeah, this is this is literally all about you building blocks. And they don't have any peace regarding this. Whoever this person is or this is you. Somebody don't have any peace. And they were trying to, you know, offer something up to something. Like, this, this person went to somewhere. Like, I'm getting, like, train tracks or something. They went to something. The number nine. Bond number nine is significant. They went and offered something up to take something from you. And if they couldn't retrieve it for themselves, they would have been happy if it just got taken from you. What I said. But that's not a fate. That's not a fated event. It was never gonna happen like that. It's not the fate. Somebody named Maya or Mia, Miguel, Michael.
It's something significant about a canopy bed. Yeah, chaos and conflict reverse. Enjoy your life. Okay. <laughs> Do you, boo? It's Tuesday. What that mean, Shanita? Whatever we want it to mean. I mean, whatever we want, whatever we wanted to mean. What I said, fam, masculine. It's Tuesday. What that mean? Whatever you want it to mean. Whatever you want to do today, you can celebrate like it's a holiday. Holla. Day. You ain't got to wait to celebrate your life. Bro, you don't got to wait to celebrate your accomplishments. You don't got to. Who? What are you waiting on? You don't, bro, don't you ever dumb yourself down or make yourself feel like you need to retreat from your damn self. Man, apply more pressure on these motherfuckers. What are you talking about? You don't got to step down and step back to feel, you know, uh, not yourself to make somebody else comfortable. Sweetheart, if making, you un if making you comfortable makes me uncomfortable, sweetie, you just won't have no fucking comfort. If I need to dumb myself down to make you feel better, sis, stay sick. What are you talking about? What the hell is you talking about? I'm sure you can find a physician to prescribe some for you, sis. Because coming over here thinking I'm going to dumb myself down and show up a person that I'm not to make you feel better. I guess you just going to be sick. That's not how it's going to go. We work too hard. Right, Phil Masculine? We work too damn hard for these lives we live in. You got life fucked up. No. You can't have anything. That's mine. No. Go get something on your own. That's what you do. I don't want shit that's yours. So why are you so invested in my shit? Girl, go get your own. This is brazy. What else is here? You want my man? Go get your own, man. You can't have my man. He don't want you. He only wants me. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? This is weird. Somebody wants everything that you got. Those are my kids, not yours. Go have your own children. You're weird. This is weird. These are my people, my soul family. Go get your own soul family. Go get your own shit. That's what I'm saying. Go go do you. I was trying to block somebody else's shit. You're not doing nothing. What else is here? Somebody nice to buy it. Yeah, that shit dead. This is something's over. These are thieves. They're thieves. They don't want to face judgment. But they are. Like I feel. Don't feel bad for being blessed, bro. Don't feel bad for being blessed. Courtship in the reverse. And don't feel bad for those people who ain't blessed. What are you talking about? Don't be feeling bad for nothing or nobody. Lead that up to the most high. Let God comfort these folk. That ain't your position. Your position is to stay firm in you and yours. And you be courteous to people, yes. But you don't sit around stressing yourself out about something that somebody else don't care about. These people don't even want to be saved. They don't want help. They don't truly want to be all right. You're of high value. All they're trying to do is drain all your value so that you won't have any either like them. These people don't truly wish to obtain value. They only want to take all your value because they know they don't have any. They got too many holes in their motherfucking soul. They could never retain value. It'll seep through from all the holes in their soul. I'm just trying to tell you the vibes. It's the truth. It's every day. Thank you for my hand heart. Thank you. Thank you for my gifts and things, guys. Yeah. Somebody trying to come towards you and, and steal a wealthy man from you? Bitch, no. You can't have him. You're fake. You can't have my man. Talking about weird. Go get your own man. Go get your own man. Go have your own children. Whatever this is, do it on your own. Stop trying to take somebody else's shit. This is weird. And then actually thinking you're gonna live good off of it too. No, sweetheart. It's gonna all come crashing down. Somebody type, you can't have what's mine. You cannot have what's mine. It's mine. Go get your own. Go get your own shit. Like I said, stay sick. 
If me dumbing myself down gonna make you feel better, stay sick, ho. Stay sick. Uncurable. Stay sick, man. I don't give a damn about that. Lover's card. You dealing with a Gemini. Too. It's an air sign. Leave a Gemini or an Aquarius. Period. That's hating on you. Literally. Hating. And stank. They stank and hating. Child, that ain't a good combination. Wait on me to fall off while you waiting, girl. You must got a hell of a patience. You must got a lot of patience, boo. You must got a lot of patience. <laughs> waiting on some shit like this right here. The baby you will be waiting forever in a rocking chair on your porch. Curse the cowardly dog. Official person and pathway. It's an official person coming down your way. Or you're already with this person or something. I don't know. It's something about an executive suite. Yeah, y'all folks top tier. Yeah, wealthy man right here change. Judication here. It's a death to the thief. You top tier. Your person top tier as well. Somebody just really mad because you came from, literally, you came from a lot. You came from a lot, okay? You, you went through a lot. I'm going to just say that. Because you ain't got to be in the hood to go through things. You could be in a $10 million motherfucking mansion with a silver spoon in your motherfucking mouth. Confirmation. And still go through trauma. Whoever you are, you've been through a lot. Don't matter how. But you here with me right now. You made it. Right? And we're going to always celebrate the fact that we're still here. We're healthy. And we still got a whole lot of things to do here. Right? And we're not letting nobody stop us because it's the only person that can stop me is me. The only person that can stop you is you. Right? Once you know that, you're unstoppable. What I said. Concern. Yep. Somebody in concern. They're in despair twice. Bro, I'm bitch. I know damn well, see, bro. I know you ain't over here sad and crying because you just can't figure it out. That's on you. This person figured it out on their own. You need to figure it out on your own. And trying to get them thrown out of their house, that's not what the fuck is going to happen. This person is not going to be homeless. They're not going to be broke, ugly, fat, none of that. That's not who they are. And they won't ever take on that energy. Ever. It'll be you and yours. It got to go somewhere. This energy got to go somewhere. You sending it at somebody that's not hitting this person who you think it's going to hit. Y'all are constantly dealing with these. Every it's like every day someone is stealing something from you. Every single day, or they feel like they can try this shit. Yeah, thoughts. They feel like they can try it. Oh, you getting married, fam? And somebody mad because their marriage is in bad health. So that's your marriage. They mad because your marriage is healthy and theirs is in bad health. So repair your marriage. Why are you trying to send energy to everybody else who got a healthy relationship for their shit to come crumbling down? Fix your fucking marriage. Y'all people mindsets are fucked up. How did you even get married? <laughs> Who the fuck would, would marry somebody with your kind of thought process? Y'all folks, half of these men be getting tricked. Let's say that first. Half of these men be getting tricked with witchcraft to marry these women and stay. Yeah, y'all folks do a lot of spell work, but you ain't finna come down that feminine way with that shit. Or this masculine, not this person I'm reading. You ain't gonna ever come down your way with this bullshit. You can stay where you at with this bullshit. So. You got a gift, man. The most high is good. My dad is good. I don't care what nobody says, lovers. Thank you for my heart, Puff. Thank you. Thank you for my heart, Puff, boo. Thank y'all for my use. Yeah, occupation reversing and there's a privileged lady. Somebody mad because you don't got to work hard. You're not a slave. They're mad because you're not a slave. Girl, this is all envy. You got men hating on you, fam. Women hating. I mean, your mom, y'all, some of y'all, y'all own damn mama is hating on you. What I said, y'all. That ain't your fault. Don't don't feel bad for being blessed. And don't feel bad because you can't take these fault with you because they betrayed you. Like what? Somebody trying to make it seem like you owe something to your family to take care of them, but they all tried to have you taken out. What are you talking about, man? Stay the fuck away from me. What are you talking about? You just want to be around me to try to get another chance to take me out. No, no. Stay away from me forever. In fact, I don't even know you motherfuckers. I'm from Alaska. 
What are you talking about? I'm from Antarctica. I don't know y'all folks. Community. And I got every right to denounce you. I don't know you. I don't know you at all. No, dead serious. I would never want to know people like this that claim to be your family and friends. And these people are trying to take your uh, life from you. All because of envy. Like I said, it's Tuesday, Shanita. What that mean? Whatever you want it to mean. Life is what you make it every single day. Life going to be whatever you want to be. Bro, y'all folk can get up and do anything you want. Thank you. I mean, from the bottom of my soul, bro. We can get up and do whatever it is we want. And we still going to be good no matter what. Whatever you feel like doing. Because you are destined to live that type of life. You came here to be spoiled. You came here to create heaven on earth. And somebody been trying to block you from that. That's why they're being punished. I promise you, these people will get wiped out before you go anywhere. Before any of us go anywhere, we're going to complete our missions and live in our missions. We're going to literally create wealth. And we're going to live to enjoy it too. Our kids, 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 kids will not have to lift a finger. And we're going to make sure because it starts with us. These people had wealth for us that we inherited and they stole it from us. They couldn't be trusted to pass it to us. What I said, they got jealous because it wasn't them and they stole it from us. We were always going to get the ball in our hand. The ball was always going to be in our court because my dad knew they were going to always mess whatever this is up. These people could never be trusted. It was literally money that was given to us. We inherited things and our family stole it. But see how God working? My dad coming right back with it. And we're creating our own legacies from us now, from us on down. Fuck them. They don't matter no more. From us on down, the children that we're creating and things like that, we're building our own bloodline. That's what I'm trying to tell you. We're literally building our own bloodline. Literally. A lot of y'all have been isolated for a reason. Don't even worry about it no more. Just live, bro. <laughs> Fuck who did what, why they did, man. Don't even, it don't even matter. Just live life, because you living life. These folks losing. I'm telling you they are. They getting up every day with bad news. Can't get shit, won't do shit. Nothing. And they sitting back mad at us. I'm telling you, every day these people come checking on your channel. They come checking on your profile. They go up to your job, sitting outside to see if your car going to pull up. This false person is running from the police. They know they about to go to prison. Yeah. Mature woman and then unexpected income. There it goes. You about to get some new money. New money, boo. New money. But whoever you are, you need money to create some. So let's just stop with the cap shit. Okay? Everybody need money, bro. Let's just talk about that. Stop talking about somebody money hungry. No, 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 no. You need money. You got to spend money to make money, bro. You, gotta, you need money to create things. You do. And some of y'all can create things that don't cost money and generate money. You dig a root skew? Don't let that go over your head. But it's something here that you're creating. You need like physical money to build this. Whatever it is you're building, Tom. And you have to spend money to build this. But it's going to generate more money. Like, um, you know, uh, the profit is, it's, it's a lot of profit right here. Profit for the profit. You dig a root skill? Profit for the profit. Longevity. Longevity, baby. That's the season we in. Longevity. These people ain't getting no messages of sudden wealth. They don't have any. They're suddenly broke. And they're suddenly locked out too. They suddenly fucked us over. And they can't even come to us and ask us for no favors. What I said. Even if you wanted to help these people, God ain't going to let you help these people. What I said. Even if you wanted to help them, my dad ain't going to let you help them. Even if you got the means to help these people, he won't let you help them. Because you're not supposed to. This is, somebody's supposed to go through karma. See? They trying to escape their karma by getting something from you. You got to use your discernment, okay? Don't feel bad for telling somebody no. Because these same people try to take your life. I'm telling you. And it's a lover coming your way. How long have I been live, y'all? Grand Rising. Hold on.
Sorry, y'all. Give me one second. <laughs> I'm hearing that song Praise is what I do I don't know who that's by Praise is what I do I don't know who that's by I used to know Who is that song by Praise is what I do It's what I do Good morning. Is it? Is it a group? Hmm. I think it's a whole choir on that song. I don't know. Somebody could be doing a balloon release for a relative that passed away. My condolences, guys. You could be doing a balloon release soon or something like that. This person really loves you. Somebody's birthday could be on Valentine's Day. Or around Valentine's Day or something. Yeah. Scorpio Cancer Pisces. This person passed away. Seems like somebody's father. Okay. You are heavily protected. You heavily protected, baby. I promise you that. You are heavily protected. One thing you don't need to worry about around here is being protected. You definitely got hella protection. Okay? You got a lot of protection right here. A lot of it. What's here? Oh, that's my brother's birthday. <clears throat> my brother passed away. This is his birthday. The hangman. Yeah, somebody, you're doing a balloon release. This is a lot of damn balloons. <laughs> like... Nine of Cups. Like, this is a lot of balloons. This is over 50 balloons or something. Make sure you record it, okay? Make sure you record this balloon release. It's so beautiful. You, you always dedicate something to this person every year. Nine of Wands. You really, really love this person. This person is showing up in this reading. They, they, this person is not playing about you at all. And they be talking to your person, too. Two of Cups, Six of Wands, Page of Swords. This person is not going to play about Nobody coming to do nothing. They ain't doing shit. Especially in the spirit. These four done lost their motherfucking mind. Two of Pentacles here. With the Knight of Swords here. It's quick communication. Ace of Cups reverse. Death. Whoever this Scorpio is who have no love for you, they're being wiped out. By their own vices. <laughs> Five of Swords because they're jealous. This is a hateful person. Very petty. Competition. Jealousy. I mean, whatever here. We? I don't know. I don't know what the hell that's like. To be an envious, jealous person, I would, I would never know how to tell you I understand. I don't. I would never understand jealousy, ever. I would never give you a pass for being jealous as fuck. Never. Nine of Cups. Never, sweetie. I will not ever understand that and give you a pass for that. I will never give you a pass for that. Jealousy? <laughs> yeah, okay. You doing all this shit because you're jealous. This person ain't did shit to you. You just want them homeless in the streets because you're jealous. Of their God given birthright. Okay. Five of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. It's a devil to the Scorpio. I'm telling you, the high priestess reverse. This person doesn't have any intuition. Somebody named Avery. Avery. A V E R Y. Or I. Okay. A V E. A V I R Y or A V I R I. Three of Pentacles. Yeah. The star. There you go, Divine Feminine. Six of Swords being guided. Seven of Pentacles investing. This feminine, this feminine on this person is meant to have a lot of money. Page of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. I can't make this up. It's like you're taking something so small. You got the Page of Cups. It's small. Whatever this is, I don't know. Something small and you're gonna turn this into millions of dollars. It's weird. Somebody don't want you to do it. They're not even helping you with this. You are the Queen of fucking Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles. Virgo energy. Nobody's blocking your money, bro. If you got Virgo anywhere in your chart, nobody's fucking with your work ethic or your money. Period. 
That's just what they can't take that from you. Just period. That's why it's a lot of people here blocking. Um, Knight of Wands here in the Temperance, okay? That's why you got so many people that go and they try to disrupt your work. What I said, they go and they report your content. They report you at work. They call your boss, lie on you, all kind of stuff. That's why they do that stuff because they cannot stop your work ethic. They can't stop you from making money. So that's why they're trying to get you like disqualified from something. But it's like you always see something ahead of time. So you're always working on something else. What I said, bro. Five of Wands. This is competition and jealousy uh, because of what you do for work. This Queen of Wands reverse doesn't have it. They don't have any creativity. They don't have no pizzazz. They don't have no razzle, no dazzle. They got none of that shit. They're not you. You're not me. You'll never be me, bitch. Ever. You never will. Knight of Pentacles. You will never do shit like me. You won't be like me. Nobody will mistake you for me or none of this. You're, you're fucking weird. This is every day. The chariot reverse. This losing ass cancer on the same thing. Every day. World card is over. Wheel of fortune is over. You're getting ran over by this empress. I'm telling you, you're getting ran over, bro. Death, wheel of fortune with the world. That's three major arcana. Four with the chariot reverse. Five with the tempers, truly. So you got Sag, uh, cancer. Scorpio, freaking Scorpio again. Double Scorpio. It's definitely a Scorpio out here. And that's all the major arcana out here right now. So I can give you a sign. But it's definitely a significant Virgo that's winning. And somebody is pissed off at this Virgo. Period. Somebody's in a five of swords. I feel like it's a Virgo being attacked by a Scorpio or Cancer. Scorpio. Double, it's, it's several Scorpio energies here. It's a Virgo being attacked, period, by a Sag, a fucking Cancer, a Gemini, a, a Scorpio, period. Just fucking period. And you're all losing. All of you are losing. All of you, you're losing. Yeah, Page of Swords, stalking. They're stalking you. There's the tower. Their whole life is in shambles. All that shit they sent to you is being sent back with the Eight of Wands reverse. It's a hateful Sagittarius here and a hateful Cancer. I mean, these are some men hating on a woman, period. I told you, King of Cups reverse. I told you it's a Cancer. Scorpio something, but it's, I feel like it's a Cancer. Two of Swords that's confused about this man that you're with or something. I heard you hit different right here, fam. You definitely do. The Ace of Wands, yeah. The Queen of Swords reverse. Whoever this Aquarius is, is a fucking liar. Ten of Swords, this person, Ten of Swords themselves. Whoever this is, they were coming in with Ten of Swords and putting your back in your foundation. They're not accomplishing this here. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to figure out why y'all people create pages just to come over here. I don't get it. They take a lot of work. You can create a page to make revenue for yourself, but you choose to create a page to stalk and troll. I'll never understand it. Eight of Wands in reverse, like I felt, it's going right back to whoever these people are. Five of Cups, they're sad, sick, and miserable. Five, six, seven of Cups? Ain't no way, bro. Bro, there is absolutely no way. Ain't, bro, it is not no way right now. Ain't no way, bro. There is no, bro, it's no way I just pulled this right here. There is no way I just pulled this. Five, six, seven, eight of cups. Synchronistic as fuck. The five, six, seven, and the eight of cups. The nine of cups is already out here. Are you kidding me? Somebody is, somebody has fucked up bad. Queen of Pentacles. I'm telling you, bro. Five, six, seven, eight. It's a countdown. Somebody don't understand. Like somebody does not. You are the empress. You are the emperor. Somebody does not understand. You are not going to lose. You're not. The fuck? I told you that. So anytime you feel down, hear me. You will not lose. You will not fall. God is going to save you. Every time you're feeling down, here's Shanita. You will not lose. 
You will win. I promise you. It's over with. It's over. You will not lose. I'm telling you, you not. I don't give a damn who's coming up against you, bro. They can't beat you. Look at all this strategic shit. Why you got to be in so much strategy to beat someone that ain't even in competition with you? You're literally going to this person to attack them. You feel like they can't exist and you win something. You can't compete with them. You feel like that. This person don't feel like that about you. You don't even exist. The hell? Two of swords. We don't even know y'all. We building a bad ten of pentacles. Nine of swords reverse. We're not stressed out about shit and we're moving on with the six of swords. We don't even know you. Why are you so stressed out about us? Like, why are you so fucking stressed out about us, bro? We are literally not worried about you at all. We don't get up every day and look this motherfucking good to impress anyone but ourselves. I check that mirror before I do anything. Bitch, I look good to me and I feel confident in what I'm doing. It's good to me. I don't give a damn about how you receive it. I'm going to put what I got out and it just let it do what it do. Because I know what I got. Top tier. <laughs> I know what I got and I bring is top tier. Everything about me is top tier. Everything. Top tier. Even what you may consider a flaw, I'm still top tier. Because it ain't a flaw to me. It ain't a flaw to my dad. And whatever you don't like about me can be fixed easily. And truly, it don't got to be fixed because I don't give a fuck about how you feel about me, truly. This is crazy. Yeah, six of pentacles. What you give is what you get. All this damn magic. The magician with the four of wands reverse and the page of pentacles reverse. You're weak. Strength reverse. You're weak as hell. This is weak ass magic. This magic is weak. I'm picking up on some weak ass magic. Shout out to all 850 of y'all in here. Thank y'all for being here. Seven of cups. It's mini illusions with the seven of coins and the sun. The sun and the bitch and the star. Girl. The sun and the star, whatever this is you're investing in with the seven of pentacles, it's making you the sun and the motherfucking star. Either way, you twinkling, you beaming, you shining, you glistening, you gleaming. That's what we're here to do. We're here to shine. Bitch, I'm not going to go in no hole for you. Fuck you. What are you, girl? I'm going to get up every day and show off. I remember days when I didn't have nothing but one outfit. I remember days when I had nothing to my name, sweetheart. You got me fucked up if you think I'm not going to put on my clothes and get cute, bitch, and do what I do, ho. That's what I like to do. Why does that matter to you? What the fuck is wrong with you? I got every motherfucking right to brag if I wanted to. God, good, sweetie. 911. Go call emergency numbers if you need help. Stop trying to come over here and steal shit. Stop trying to blame somebody else for what you lack. The fool. Very foolish. Stop trying to make somebody else feel like they're not worthy because you feel like you ain't worthy. Stop doing that shit because it don't work. We know we worthy. Somebody type I am worthy in capital letters because we indeed are. We the one with the gifts. And this is a specific gift that you've been trying to block this person from. You're not getting it. You're not worthy of it. You're not this person. It's for them. We got their name on it. Let me get y'all one more card. We gonna get up out of here. Somebody type, I am worthy. I am worthy. I am worthy. Somebody type, you are worthy. Let somebody else know that they are worthy. Let your fellow soul family in this reading, let them know that they are worthy. Somebody type, you are worthy. I am worthy. Let someone else know, bro, you are worthy. I'm telling you, you is. Confirmation. Confirmation. You're worthy, bruh. It's just nothing that you're going to tell me. You're not, you're not going to ever tell me that I don't deserve something. You're not going to tell me that. I deserve whatever the fuck I want. I can have any man I want. I can have any amount of money I want. I can take over any platform I want. Because that's me. If that's what I want to do. And sweetie, you don't ever want me to go into a mode to where I'm just not finna stop. Because Virgos, we do too much. Especially with work, we do too much. You don't ever want me to go full throttle on your motherfucking ass. So I suggest you sit the fuck back. 
You gotta go and report and stalk and do shit like that. You gotta go do shit like that because you can't break me. You can't stop me. So you gotta try to see what rules I'm breaking and report in. That's the only way you feel like you can get rid of Shanita. By doing some underhanded shit. That's a layup. You always do underhanded shit to try to bring the chosen ones down. Because we're unstoppable. So you try to use worldly things against us. And you're still not able to beat us. This shit is supply on demand. I'm highly recommended and highly sought after. People come looking for me. They come looking for the feminine or this masculine. You just can't stop that. People gonna always love Shanita. Always. They gonna always care for Shanita and her kids. Whatever fuck. Whoever I am or whatever I got going on, people gonna always love me and support me. Those who really love me and support me. It's nothing you're gonna do about it. Go get your own family. Go build up your own shit. Confirmation and stop trying to fucking eat off my shit. Whatever I need is right here in this little deck right here. I'm not going to pull many of these. Yeah, that's real. Y'all folk really out here smiling. Somebody mad because your smile ain't fake. Oh, they just faking like they happy. No, you're not. You're really happy. Somebody mad because you're really happy. And them all your real teeth. What I said. Them your real teeth right here, fam. Masculine. Man, y'all folk better smile. Smile big as you motherfucking can. I got teeth missing and I'm going to smile. I don't give a flying fuck. We don't care no more, do we? We don't care. It's, it's, it, this shit is just so old to me. It's old. It's old. Somebody wants you back because they're bankrupt, literally. They're, they broke. They're broke as fuck. They, they, they may be trying to even get you in the bed. You don't want nothing to do with them. This person don't want you to protect yourself because they're a player. They want to leave evidence behind. That they deal with you or something. Somebody may be trying to get you pregnant. Same shit, different day. They're very toxic. Somebody could be pregnant, but I don't feel like you know. And I don't feel like it's by this person. You are not broke and you ain't going fucking broke. That's why somebody's in their head. Okay? Somebody was also trying to ruin your reputation with lies about sexual intercourse. Trying to claim that you're a whore or whatever. You get rooms like you're a prostitute. They were lying. They were trying to get you locked up too because your light irritates their demons and they're on drugs. This right here sums up all of this energy. Their own drugs. This person really truly need to get some kind of like therapy. Like they need to get off this shit. If this person can get off of these drugs that they're on, they would probably be able to ascend to a higher consciousness. They'll never get on your level though. But like they'll get up higher than where they at, I guess. They're, this person's brain is fried from drugs and other things. Other extracurricular activities is what, what I just heard here. Please. I mean, they dabbling a lot. This person feel like they've done too much sin to turn back to get forgiveness from God. Sweetie, just because my dad forgive you, that don't mean he just going to make your life peaches and cream. Just because you get forgiveness do not mean you're in the goal to be abundant and just parade around like you ain't did shit, sweetheart. No, my dad will forgive you, but he going to take your ass through the fire. You still will get your shit rocked for everything that you did to someone. Just because you go and say, God, forgive me, does not mean he forgot. That don't mean that. A person can forgive all day. You can be forgiven all day. That don't mean we finna let you slide. You don't, you, you're not gonna, ain't nobody gonna let you slide with the shit you did. You might not be paying for it now. Oh, but trust me, you will pay. I promise you that. It's gonna be at the worst time possible. It's gonna be at the most inconvenient time. That's when karma like to show up. But see, karma don't need your permission to enter. She gonna come kick the door down. She coming through the window. She coming down the chimney, motherfucker. Santa, she's coming. With a bag of coal or gifts, one or the other. Karma is going to come get your ass. I don't see why people don't know about karma. But if you don't know about karma, you better look her up. You Google everything else. You better go Google karma. Yeah, you better go Google karma. Karma, look, God, that, that name ring a lot of bells, baby. And for you to be so oblivious to karma, I wonder what else you are oblivious as fuck to. That's crazy. Let me close this reading. Because you a bugaboo. You bugging what you bugging who you bugging me. And don't you see it ain't cool, groupie. You stalking motherfuckers. Stalking. Lying. Lurking. Spying. Crying. Lying. 
She be lying. Y'all told some fucking lies. Be lying on the damn feminine. I don't appreciate the lies that were told on this woman or this man. Because you definitely were lying because you are everything that you were lying saying that this person was. That's who you are. And then you try to steal this woman's fucking essence and try to walk in her energy. Don't worry, fam. No, don't worry. I love you. Divine Masculine love you. We love you. Okay, Masculine, we love you. Divine Fam love you. We all love you, bro. We love y'all, sis. Don't worry about these people. Trust me, they're going to get what's coming to them. And you're going to reign supreme like you were always going to anyway. Somebody named me Logro. Ask and receive. I can't make it up. You're getting a lot of intuitive downloads right now. Pay attention and then take charge and action. Like I told y'all yesterday, remember what I told you about this idea? If you know, you know. I ain't going to talk so much about that. But um, you got to be real busy. But ask and receive. Yeah. You're building generational wealth. Nobody's going to block this. Cut the cords from the things that do not serve your purpose. We Remember that guy loves you and saw the last six, seven, eight in the chat. I'll see you guys later. Y'all have a great day, okay? Bye. Oh, it's definitely 880 of y'all in here. I'm sorry.